Hello everyone, my name is Flair Blitz here and welcome to the newly released game of Angel of Death over on Steam. Now this is a game that has been announced quite a while ago, but ever since then I've been really looking forward to playing this game like other Jimmy Go Horror games like Pocket Mirror and the stuff besides that. So, well, in retrospect, I'm going to start from episode one, because I believe that's how time works, so... Okay, uh... Right, failed to initialize direct audio. Okay, so what happened there was I had the target window locked on to the launcher software and then I realized that Angel of Death loads up on another window so I had to just readjust it so that it loads up in a new window. But it did say there was an audio error beforehand which is a bit strange, but anyways. We shall get on to the first episode of the game. Hmm. It's been finally released after some time in English. I believe the original t translator was supposed to be Tasaiki, but I believe he... It's either the case that uh, he's lost interest over time to translate games, or there's something else involved. Okay, so our keys are 246A... Number pad, shift keys to run, decide to talk, set enter. So pretty much the same sort of concept as other RPG Maker games, which is very good. My webcam is playing up. Hmm. Hi. How are you? Hmm. A blue full moon. Is it night? Where am I? I was at a hospital. Oh, that's right. I'm pretty sure I was in the medical exam room. At any rate, i got to hurry and find mum and dad. No, your mum and dad are already dead. Oh, this is Ray, Rachel Gardner. I, I was obviously joking by that, by the way. So I believe this was made in, uh, it looks like either VX or VX Ace, or XP. Strange moonlight illuminates the room. What a beautiful, sorry, what a blue and beautiful moon. It doesn't even look real. Maybe, maybe it's an artificial moon. There's a white chair. Right, so there's anything else in here, in here. This is a security camera, it's mounted the ceiling. All of the sides. Security cameras for monitorization. This isn't the same hospital as before. Hmm. So what would this be? And the outside is perfectly ideal for recording as it's not too bright. It appears to be for inserting a key. Hmm. There's writing on the wall. Who are they? To know, thou must find out for thyself. It is thine true self, or thine desired self. Desired self. An angel. A sacrifice. Know thyself and the gate shade open. Somebody has gone very Shakespeare with us. Hmm. More security cameras. Fine. There's a machine with a card inside it. It appears the card cannot be taken out. Okay, what about the computer then? Okay, that's turned off. Your reflection is cast in the mirror. Just my usual self. That opened up something. Ah, the PC fired up as soon as we looked in the mirror. The computer automatically powered on, initiating some sort of program. The info screen is open. Enter data. Please answer the following. Name. Rachel Gardner. 
age. 13. What are you doing here? I'm pretty sure I was at a hospital, and when I came to, I was here. Why? 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 Why the hospital? I saw someone. I saw someone die. It happened right in front of me. So, I was brought here for counselling. What will you do now? Leave this place. I want to see my mum and dad. Entry complete. Distributing place dark key card. Ah, that is how you can get a card in that case. A card is sticking out from the inside. Acquired a card. Can I get out of this place if I use this? Still, I wonder what it means by play start. Computers often shows no sign of powering up, even when pressing buttons. Fine. Save again. You may, you may never know. Uh, yeah, it's a bit mysterious. It appears to be for inserting a key card. Items we inventory can be used in specific locations by selecting them from the menu. Fine. We shall select it from the inventory bin. Insert the card key. Ooh, that doesn't sound good. Hmm. Just check around the scenery one more time, just to be sure. Okay, there's nothing new. We'll just be on our merry way. Because one of those mirrors in there did seem pretty distinctive. If you go in here and check like, the framings on the top. Yes, and these ones, you don't have a... Ref oh my god, the frames are a bit jockey when it goes in the mirrors. There's something to note there in the patch update, developers. The el this elevator, it only has an up button. That's odd. I don't remember being here in this basement. The girl on the bottom floor is here by a sacrifice. All floors, please make preparations. The auntie lays the play area. The gate will now open. Hmm? Bad announcement just now. What does it mean? I do not know, but uh, all I can tell you, girl, is that you are in a bit of danger. It appears to be an elevator that goes to an upper floor. The elevator only has an up button. Hold off. Is there anything else in here which we can use? Nothing else. Computer is off. Security cameras. The security cameras were probably how they knew I was moving about. Security camera. Beautiful moon. Beautiful moon. Itchy nose. Not part of the gameplay. I know. There's a hole in the wall. The gate was unlocked by the gate. The, the, the gate was unlocked by the car key. Right. Right, we need to take the elevator because that's the only way we can advance the story. But what did it mean by a sacrifice? Floor B6. The elevator stopped. Am I inside a building? Something's not right here. Anyway, where's the way out? That bin on the left looks like it's infested with flies. There are heaps of garbage. Flies buzz around the garbage. It says B6. So we're definitely not anywhere in which you could call outside. What's the point of these road markings? If you can't advance through. Hmm. Gotta hurry. What do you mean gotta hurry? Is there something nearby? I don't recognize this place at all. Why? Why am I here? There's a newspaper. Will it shed some light in this place? Or some darkness? 
a reckless murderer on date redacted. The body of a male was found on street redacted in state redacted. The body has gaping wounds seemingly infected by a sharp blade. Authorities are treating it as a murder. Since last month, a string of similar murders have taken place in this state. No association or similarities have been drawn with a victim. So nearby residents are asked to exercise caution. An article about a murderer? Yes, yeah, an article about a murderer. It looks like a back alley. I'm a little scared to go down it. Don't worry, there are no creepers down there. Not as far as we can tell. Okay, so this is a, a road or a sewer. Hmm. I was reading through a few of the Steam comments, and some people say that it gave them heart attacks. But we're used to these sort of horror games, and we need to find out the horrors themselves. Blood. Hmm. But this is the basement of a building. The door is shut and boarded up. Something's a little off on this place. I can see a brownish red stain in the back of the road. Is that... Is that what I think it is? Yep. It's the B. And the L. And the O. And the other O. And the D. And it's not Dick, by the way. It's blood. Not so blood. Hmm? We can walk through that. I bet it just must be the game's mechanic of going through a hole. You're so just necessarily climbing through. There's a large shovel. It looks a touch heavy to carry. But we may need it for self-defense. In the last resort, you could just use its big weight to smash down on the op opposition. The door's locked. Right, so if that door's locked, then... Something smells awful. Yeah, maybe the garbage smells awful. Okay, so let's go up here. The door's locked, but there's no keyhole to be found. And imagine the exit mark. Next to it says elevator passage. Is the elevator in there? But it won't open. There's not even a keyhole. How am I supposed to open it? I've got to find a way to open this door. Guess I'll take a look around. Places I've yet to explore. See, so here we go from episode one. Episode 2, Episode 3, and then Episode 4. Back alley. It just seems the most relevant way of doing it. The inside of the locker is empty. Mm, it appears the door is boarded up, but the space inside lacks depth. Okay. There are tin cans in the garbage can. It's a glass bottle, but contents have been drank to the last... Drop to the last drop, it seems, and we as one cannot find what it is that we need. No, it's not that we can't. Ah, a bird is chirping from the hole in the roof. What are you doing in a place like this? Come here. Are you weak? How can I get down? Get down here. How can I get down here? I wonder if it's hungry. I wonder if it wants you for your bodily parts as food. Hmm. Look around up where the pipe is covering up as well because it could be quite conceal concealing. Uh, nope, don't need that. There's a door, but it's locked. Right, so we do need to go down these alleyways. It's just the absolute norm. And there's something inside there, but we're going to read this newspaper article first. A back alley murder. On date redacted, yet another body was found. On street redacted, in state redacted. A nearby resident was found in a town's back alley. It's believed to be a teenage boy, but his identity is unknown. The body sustains severe lit lit literation. No. 
lacetate oh, I can't say that word and the incident has been treated as one of several several ser serial murders serial murders yep because it means multiple there are traces of reddish brown splatter of some sort it reeks of blood yep now you start to understand graffiti how is it that I'm indoors, but it looks just like a back alley? Hmm. Something's inside the hole. Acquired a key. Where does this... Where does... So which door does this key open? The back left door doesn't have a keyhole, so it must be meant for another door. Good. Maybe we can find the answers in one of those places. One of those places. But beware for horrors. For the hollers! Is it this one up here? The door is locked. Okay, so. Aha! It's for this door. Go up and then go down. Invest in another save file. You never know what may lurk around the corner. Okay, we'll investigate this room first. I always like to uncover everything that the game offers to the player. There's a large box, but it's rusted shut. There's no water running. You may not want to drink water in here. It's probably very stale and disgusting. I want to get out of here now. You're going to have to work for it. Sorry, sweetheart. There's some sort of drug. No dr drug to... B okay. A serial killer. On date reducted, remains of Joan Smithy was found in a factory in town reducted, state reducted. Based on the rooms, it is believed to be the work of a serial killer who has shaken up this town. The factory worker John Smithy, 20, 26, gosh, that's a young age, was a hard-working, earnest, and upstanding young man. The incident occurred on the same day he had excitedly told co-workers he was getting a new car. This random murder spree has plunged the town into fear. I'm inside a building, aren't I? There appears to be some sort of staff uniform inside. It appears to be some sort of storage cabinet that's shut tight. It appears to be some sort of storage cabinet shut tight. Ah, oh, it appears to be some sort of factory machine meter, but it isn't working. Okay, so we definitely need to go in here to find more clues towards what we can do. There's a large box, but it's rusted shut. It's lined with expired canned goods and containments. There's nothing inside the closet. Old tableware is on the shelf. Old tableware is on the shelf. The box only contains junk. This box only contains rubbish in it. How dare thy thee? Trash is strewn everywhere. It's a sofa with tightly coiled springs. I know there's something there, which is why I missed it on purpose. You may never know what we may find when we don't have the item. Anyways, we'll grab it. The only thing left in this large box is a single bag of snacks. Yes, now we can eat. What a waste of a box this big to be empty. Heck, it looks like I can fit myself into it with room to spare. Or maybe we can use it as a hiding spot of sorts. Anyways, we'll continue for a little longer and then we shall be on our merry way. Right, so the only thing we found in this room was some snacks, but I wonder what else we could... Wait, inventory. Okay, so we used a key up, so we need to find something else along the ways here soon, rather than later. Sorry if my webcam is out of frame. I'm looking at my playback and it is way off. It's not meant to be like that. It really is not. Right, so... Right, so if I can't access that right now, then there's something else in which I need to explore. There's a door, but it's locked. Uh... Well, then again, there's nothing back here in which I found. Oh, we can get... Ah, wait. Ah, wait, 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 wait. We can use a bag of snacks on this birdie. Would it eat this? Opened a bag of snacks. It's, yeah, it's got an injured left wing. 
One of his wings is covered in blood. Hey, are you hungry? Good. Eat it all up now. I thought it was actually a much bigger bird because of the shape of the hole. You're so precious. Satan's hunger won't help it fly. I've got to make you all better. Aw, it's alright. Hold still. Now you should be fine. But I worry, so you come in with me. A quiet injured bird. Now you make it sound like if it's an object. It's not an object. It's life. It's a life source. Now it sounds like energy. It's coming from a passage on the other side. What's that sound? It's scaring the bird. I don't know, but that doesn't sound good. What is out here? Well, I'm glad that did. Hello? No, I've got to get out of here. It's alright, don't be scared. Heavy shutters down, blocking the way. Wait. Don't be scared. Let's leave this place together. Okay? Well, come here. <laughs> oh, my. Wipe that stupid smug look off your face. And surrender to despair. I'll give you a three second head start. How far can you run? Oh, I know where to hide. Now cry, scream and beg for your life. Show me the despair on your face. Yes, more! Get away from me, Zack! Oh, you think you're so funny, don't you? Don't you? This box! We got that hint from earlier when we got the snacks. Ha! Huh. Where the hell did that person go? I don't like saying profanity words in games. This room. Sheesh, it's locked. Guess I'll unlock it. Is it gone? It is. I hope it doesn't come back. I gotta escape this place before it finds me. If it catches me. The bird. The bird. The bird's dead. It looks pretty dead. The door is open. I can go over here now. Did it unlock it? Okay, so it was in here. It appears to be empty. There's a locked hatch on the floor. It says in small print elevator passage control room. Maybe a back left door will open from here. It appears to be empty. It's junk. Right, so that act that person actually was really useful because it also opened up another passage for us, which was I worry about the bird. I don't think the bird is what you yeah. The bird is ripped in two. At least let me give it a proper burial. Come here, I'll take you there. Is there anywhere around here that'll make a decent grave? What about some tools? Hmm. Yes. I should be able to bury this poor little guy here with a shovel. No. You're not my little birdie. Not like this, not like this. You shouldn't look like this. This is just cruel. I 
I've got a big shit little birdie. Yeah, you're all better now. I'll make my birdie all better. Look, good as new. All that's left is to bury it. Hmm. Okay. Something's on the ground. Ah, oh, come to think of it. I had a feeling that something fell out of its stomach earlier. Another key! It's crazy but you swallowed something like this. Good. Okay, folks, that is going to be all of the time I'm going to spend on this episode. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I have. Please check out the game for yourself for yourself on Steam. It's £6.29 at the moment for the UK. It's on a special discount until Boxing Day. So you've got only six days left for the uh, discount before it runs out. But hopefully you had a little peek of this game through my video and you'll be able to come up from a conclusion from that if you want to buy it or not. It looks really good. I must say that right now. It does look quite well detailed. So thank you very much for watching, folks. And we shall see each other on the next time of Angel of Death, Episode 1. Have a good day and take care of yourselves.